Hey there, this is a quick tutorial on how to create a zip folder with the Mac OS. Uh, you do not need any um, software, you don't need to buy anything like Stuff It. Uh, I think there's a program called Stuff It. Um, everything you need is right here in the OS. So let's click on the Finder window, which will pull up a new Finder window. Let's say we want to send a bunch of, bunch of pictures in an email document to somebody. Uh, let's just choose some of these pictures. I, whoops, I didn't mean to uh, click on that one. Let's see, I'll shift, I'll select this one, I'll shift click here to highlight all of them. If I hold down Command, I can just select a couple more pictures. Let's say I want that one and that one, that one. Okay, so I'm going to leave this finder window <clears throat> just like this. If I do Command N, it gives me a brand new window, which can help for moving files around. Uh, so I'll I, I select the desktop. So th right now there's nothing on the desktop. Uh, so under this little flower, I'll say I want a new folder. And I'll call it Photos for Email. Call it that. <clears throat> now I'll double click that folder. I'll open it. Now all those photos I had here, if I hold down Option, this is going to make a copy of all these. So I'm, just in case I, you know, I, I don't want to leave them, uh, I don't want to move them around. I want to make a copy and send it. So I'm, I'm dragging that. I drop it. It comes in here. All right. I hit this back arrow, which gets me back to to see the view of the folder I just created. Okay, so here's how we do it. Um, if we want to send all these files, uh, whatever type of files <coughs> we want, they can be different type, PNG, JPEG, MP3, uh, whatever. It can be uh, anything, a GarageBand project. Um, I'm going to close that up. What you want to do is hold down Control, which is... Uh, going to give you the right click option for a mouse. And, and then once I click on that folder, there's an option called compress uh, for email. Uh, com compress. The, what, that's the function you want, compress. So I select that, and there is my zip folder. And so that way, if I want to email it or send it through Mega Upload or another online uh, free sharing service, um, I only have to attach one thing and not six or twenty or whatever. Alright, well I hope this is helpful and I look forward to seeing your comments.